welcome to week three of the five minute flower challenge. So this week's a little bit different. We're stepping outside and I'm gonna do some foraging for greenery and some local bloom. Um, just to show you how you can find really cool stuff just in your backyard, in the local park, or even over your neighbor's fence. So um, today I'm actually in my grandparents' garden. Um, they've got a pretty big backyard and front yard. I'll try and show you around as we're going. Um, they have lots of different bushes growing, a few flowers, um, lots of veggies and a few fruit trees. So um, I'm going to take you through and show you what I can pick up. So let's go. So all you need is a park or a backyard and some flower shears. And I'm just going to have a look around. So there's actually some really cool some camellia growing here at the moment and it's got these amazing flowers but it's also got these little buds um, which look really nice as greenery so I'm just going to grab some of those and use them in an arrangement. So I've also come across these so on this orange tree you can see there's some little green buds here which make really cute uh, winter greenery, so I'm gonna snip a few of those off. Me and my funny <laughs> G'day granddad. <laughs> so what have you got here that we can we can steal? Anything you like to take. Alright, I've seen some daisies you know, over there. I need a kiss. Um, uh, that'll do. Sold. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I've just spied a a clump of daisies growing here. There's not actually that many daisies yet because it's not really the right time of year, but the greenery is actually really nice. And it's got these little tiny buds on it too. I don't know if you can see that. Um, so I'm just going to grab a few stems of that. Not too many because I don't want to carve up the entire garden. And there's also this fern here that's quite pretty, so I might have a go with that too. And then I'm going to mix all of that with these amazing double tulips that I bought from the markets. So starting with my camellia branches, I'm just going to snip away any of the extra greenery from below the waterline so we've got a nice clean stem and then create a bit of a frame for our arrangement with those larger camellia branches. And then I'm going to tuck in a little bit of citrus and going to start going in with the tulips now. So I'm going to keep them fairly long to start with and then I'll stagger the heights a little bit as we go, just popping them in randomly in the arrangement to, to fill it out and give it a bit of colour. And then I'm just going to pop in some of this pretty, uh, I guess it's a mystery weed, but it looks really nice and dangly out the side and it gives a nice little bit of texture. And going to go in with the maidenhair fern just to add a bit of greenery and I love how it sort of dangles out the top of the vase. Then all you need to do is go back in with a couple of feature flowers. So I'm just going to pop in another camellia, uh, fix up my tulips a little bit and that's pretty much it. You're done. So there you go. I'm really loving how this turned out and I can't wait to see what you guys get up to with the flowers that you find around where you live. Don't forget to post your pictures to the 5 Minute Flowers group on Facebook or to Instagram and we will check out what you've done. See you guys next week.